Hello everyone and welcome back to Metroid Samus Returns. Let's activate our lightning armor and let's give this the spin cycle and see where we can go now. There we go. Deactivate the lightning armor. Yep, this is definitely the way you're supposed to get up here. I mean, I do like the way that I did it with the, uh, the bomb jumping, but that was going to be way too annoying. So, we're just spinning our way up, spinning our way up, wait, spinning our way up, spinning our way up. Uh, this is your skin policy, because I think it's going Okay, there's actually nothing to scan pulse. Interesting. But up there is a door. Uh, looks like a damage. Oh no, it's not a damage door. Let's see what's inside. Okay, so those are uh, slimy walls. We can't do anything with those. With our uh, spider ball. There we go. And let's put on the spin cycle. Alright. This is, this is, uh, okay. Okay, so we can't go this way, because that, that stuff just, like, stops us from going. So I'm wondering about just, like, a blank void. I'm wondering about this just, like, a blank void right there. Oh! What the heck? Oh! That is a very mean... There we go! Now! Missile away! Fire at will! Yes, your name is Will. Come on. Wait! Phase... Oh, phase two. Come on. I do like how they're getting more creative with these fights. Come on. Oh, did not mean to do that. Oh. No. I'm doing a lot better in these fights, though, which is something I'm glad about. Come on. Nope, I didn't mean to jump down there. Yeah! Get blasted. Uh, that's probably a super missile door right there. I wonder if we can actually get super missiles. Come on. Let me, uh... Yeah, that's a super missile door. So we can't do anything... Cannot do anything with that just yet. So, I, we have to go along the long way to get out of here now. Okay, well, I am glad that we're actually going through these Metroids pretty quickly now. That it was just, okay, we need to equip you so you can get, you know, uh, Spider Ball. Spider Ball. That makes sense why you can't go up there, because that would just kind of break the fight if you could get right up there immediately by going over here. Which means... Uh, Okay, I have acrophobia, and that, right, anytime I make any sort of large jump in games, I always get, like, the pit in my stomach that just grows and just grows, because I just, I, I guess, like, I feel the, the drop, and I do not like it at all. There we go. Yeah, I, I just... It's a weird, like, psychological thing that happens where I feel the drop. Nope. Oh. Alright. Uh, you... Uh, you know I'm just gonna run through here. I don't wanna fight you guys. I'm not gonna bother fighting you guys, because I don't need to fight you guys. i pretty sure I don't need to fight you. I'm... Saying, is this the way we have to go? This is probably the way we have to go... Uh, that makes me so nauseous. I don't like it. I don't like that. But, nope. We'll just roll back up. Roll 
back up, roll back up. Okay, so I actually have absolutely no idea where I'm supposed to be going, and I kind of like that because I mean, oh, I say that as I find a secret. And so roll and roll and roll in, just keep on rolling. Um, I mean, it's a good grind spot. Wow. I say it's a good grind spot right as I run out of missiles. Well, I should probably switch beans. There we go. Oh, it's a uh, bomb. Uh, please think it doesn't regenerate. Missile tank acquired. I do wonder what breaks these. Wait. I can snipe them through here. Like, this is a pretty good spot to just grind by just shooting through, these, through this wall. <laughs> Why is the wave beam so awesome? Why is it so awesome? Oh, yeah, I know, because it's a wave beam. I think I know how I have to go. I think I have to go there. To, uh, I have to go here, but I will also check out right here, see if there's anything there, but I need to go up there too. Again, touch screen, very helpful for the map, I do like this. Boop. Rolling, 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 just keep on rolling. Oh no, do I... Do I actually have to go all the way around? Do I actually need to go all the way around again? Well, okay, it's not like it was that long. It's just kind of annoying. Okay. Wow, I completely bypassed this ledge. Uh, this is not a Metroid room? Okay. So... Oh! Oh! Uh, surprise boss fight! Whoa! Come on. Freaking Sonic the Hedgehog right here! Oh, we can't destroy those fireballs. Okay. Uh, so we are facing Sonic the Hedgehog right here. Like, I was kind of right that it was a boss door. Okay. Uh, I should probably go grab some health. That's probably why there's that little uh, tunneling thing above there. We can't go through here. Oh. I can wall jump! I will reacquire some health and I will be back in a little bit. Alright. Let's, let's see if the ice beam actually does anything to you. Oh, ice beam does not do anything to you. I do not. Oh, oh. Oh, I was actually surprised that I did that. But also makes a little bit of sense that they would give you the spring ball before coming here. Another spring ball, the uh, high jump boost. Sorry, I think of another jump boosting item. So, this guy's whole thing is like spinning attacks. Um, oh! Oh, he aims! He aims! He's an aimbot! Sonic the Hedgehog's brother is an aimbot. So, I mean, it makes sense why they give you the high jump boost because if this guy is the next boss fight. You know, they kind of have to be nice in you and give you something that you can actually use against them. What? Oh! Oh! Landing armor. Landing armor. Oh! He still damages me. Oh no, he just takes the Aeon energy. He just takes the Aeon energy away from me when you get hit. Okay, well there's my Aeon energy. Come on! A few more. Oh! Wow, one more, wow. And now you die, and 
we get a thing. Yep. Oh, the spring ball. <laughs> we get a spring ball. Nice. Spring ball acquired. Spring ball allows you to jump while in morph ball form. Uh, I'm assuming. Uh, we probably need to escape some way. Oh, there it is. Oh, interesting. So. Oh, right, we probably have to, like, spring jump out of here. This is fun. I like this. I, I like this. They're being very clever. Uh... <laughs> I love the puzzles. I love the puzzles they're making. And that's the way out. Again, the puzzles they're making are absolutely brilliant. So, now, so now how am I, am I supposed to like use this to get somewhere or something? Nope. Okay. So, this is what I'm supposed to do with this thing now? Because that... Actually, I should probably get rid of the thing on my map. Because I can't really think of anywhere else. Because like, we can't go there. Because we need super missiles for that. Yeah, alright. So, I will meet you guys... Probably back around the... Uh, that. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. I'll be heading over there. All right, so I decided to just go to the elevator and head down it just to make sure, well, that's where we have to go. Because I want to be sure that's the right way. Again, we have the awesome music. Let's rush on through. I should probably actually get some help off these guys. love this music. I'm pretty sure this is the music from, like, Grimstar, I think is what it's called, to, like, Ridley's area in Metroid, uh, in Metroid uh, Zero Mission. But I, mean, I love it. It's a great music. Okay, so... That means that this was entirely wrong going this way. Well. That's what trial and error is for. So, where's the hidden block? It was supposed to be somewhere in here. It's not anywhere. Okay, they're not here. Wow, overhead counter. Wow. Hello. What do we have here? Uh, we have... Energy? Yes, we have energy! Energy fully restored. That's actually helpful. And it also is right near a teleport beacon. That is very convenient for us. Oh, wait, right, I can just shoot to the ground and zap you guys. There we go. Such creative, clever thinking for you, Chozo. And now that I can do that, I don't need to use this, uh, the bomb jumping. As much as I like bomb jumping, it is kind of annoying and tedious, but... Oh. Oh. Oh, high jump now lets me reach that. Nice. So now I think what we're supposed to do is we're supposed to go back. And go... Here. Wait. 
Actually, I think it might be a little quicker if I go there. I... I actually have no idea where I'm supposed to go. And I kind of like this. But again, awesome music. So we'll just... We'll just head through here. Blast our way on through. Our blast our Aeon through. There we go. I like how there's a, like that that vent right there, like kind of hinting that there's lava under here. Again, little details, but always the great ones. Heck? I'm willing to bet this is not where a Metroid is, just because that's how my luck has been going. But I can never take those chances. Wait! Metroid Husk. Okay. I am liking my odds. I am liking my odds that I'm hearing the beeping. I'm liking what I'm hearing. I guess this was the right idea after all. Come on. Get in range. There you are. There we go. Go up here. Blow that away. And Metroid time. Oh. Uh, crap. My DS is low on battery. I'm pretty sure this battery in this thing is just shot for some reason. But I do leave the thing on all night, so that's probably also not helping. I probably should shut it off after I'm done recording just to kind of like, keep battery life not crappy. But, oh, there we go. There we go. There you go! Now that I finally know the talent, also, you're looking really cool with that color scheme. But, color scheme does not make an undefeatable enemy. Instead, you shall die! You decay into nothing, and we slurp you up. And now that we have acquired the final piece of Metroid DNA, the Chozo gate can now be opened, which is good for us, because our job is exterminate the Metroids. Uh, visuals? Or nothing. Okay, so we just have to head back out. And again, spider ball, spider ball. Don't regenerate. Good. I do like how clever and creative things are being, and I, I like that they actually make it so you, uh, you have to have the spring ball. Also, wow, I can't believe I killed something all the way over here. But, I am thinking I'll meet you guys back at that gate, and also now the uh, energy restoration point makes more sense. Because it's a boss fight, and they want you to at least be, like, somewhat prepared for it. Makes me wonder, what's, what's up here that was an impasse for me? Uh, um, so what was... What was the impasse for me up here? Okay, there's nothing there. Uh, I guess I'm, it's not even like this is a jump, a spring ball exclusive thing. I mean, it's like Bomberman, I guess. And I just didn't even come in here. Wow. Missile tank acquired. Vision books. Okay, that's probably a break of a block. Yep. All right. I will meet you guys back at the Chozo Gate. I 
because I'm not sure that anything of interest is going to be going on between here, but... Okay. I think I'm going to realize that maybe the Metroid discarded shells actually mean nothing, because we just left two discarded Metroid shells. Oh, wait. Wait, there were two Metroids down here, and I'm, I'm stupid. I'm, I'm stupid. Maybe I'm not. Yeah, but I'll see you guys back over at the gate. 